One of the questions I hear all the time is, where do I go to meet a great guy? And the truth is, there isn't a magical place. Because if there was, everyone would go there. Today we're going to talk about blind dates. Blind dates can be a wonderful opportunity to meet a great guy, but it can also be a horrible experience. And if you've had a blind date before, you know what I'm talking about. So today I'm going to give you a tip on how you can increase your chances of helping those who are trying to help you. Let me tell you this quick story. Several years ago, my cousin sent me out on this blind date. And other than the fact that this girl and I both were single and we both breathed air, we had absolutely nothing in common. And what's interesting about this story is I dated my cousin's best friend for almost three years. So you would think she would kind of know what I was looking for and what was important to me. And to say this girl and I were like oil and water is an understatement. So that night when I came home, I marched immediately into my cousin's room and I was like, Lisa, what happened? And she's like, what do you mean? And I said, how could you set me up with this girl? We have absolutely nothing in common. And her response really helped me see the approach and the intention of those who try and set us up. And her response was, well, you're single and she's single and you're both nice guys. So I figured I'd just set you up. And like I said, we had absolutely nothing in common. And it was at that point it made me realize is that people who care about you want to see you with somebody because they want to see you happy. But unfortunately, they don't look at what's important to you. So if you have someone who's trying to set you up or maybe they have a prospect already in line for you, Ask them a few questions. Ask them about this person. Tell them what you're looking for and ask them to honestly assess if this person has those qualities that you're looking for. And if they're not, you can talk to that person, but just don't waste your time. Okay? So that's this week's Smarter Dating Tip. We'll see you next week. Have an awesome week.